All right, hey everyone, David here, and in this quick video, I'm going to show you how to add quick view functionality to your WooCommerce store for free. So let's jump right into it. All right, this is pretty much a fresh WordPress installation, uh, and I do have WooCommerce installed on here, along with a few other plugins, but let's actually install the quick view plugin. So let's head over to plugins and add new. And the plugin that we are looking for is called Al ultimate quick view search for that i'll scroll down a little bit the plugin that we are going to install is this one ultimate quick view for woocommerce i do actually have it installed so all i need to do is click activate and this will create a settings page over under the woocommerce tab so i go here to quick view and actually without um, configuring anything in the back end, this will already work. So when I go here, I get this new button here right below the add to cart button. So when I click on the quick view button, um, it will show me all the details to this specific product. Of course, it will work with WooCommerce default uh, gallery feature here. And obviously I can add that product to the cart. And depending on your theme, this will also instantly show here in the cart menu item. Uh, the theme I'm using here is called Page Builder Framework. So if you want to check that out, I will have a link down below in the description. All right. This will work with any product, also with group products and variable products. Like I think this one is a variable product. Yep. So I can click here, choose my color, select whether I want to have that logo here or not and it will adjust the screenshots automatically for you as well. So let me add that green variation or actually two of these green hoodies uh, to my cart and boom, there you have it. So this is pretty much already it. Um, now let's head over to the back and see what options we have for this plugin. So again, I go to the WooCommerce section here in the WordPress admin and go to quick view and I will be presented with these options. I can disable the quick view feature from here or only specifically disable it on mobile devices. And I can click here if I want to remove all data from the database when this plugin is uninstalled. All right, uh, we can change the quick view button position here. So let's move it right below the product image and change the button text. Um, let's say preview. Let's hit save and go back to the front end and hit refresh. So now it says preview and it's right below um, the product image. The plugin usually automatically detects the colors defined in the theme. As you can see here, this is the theme's default blue and this will also show up here. But just in case it doesn't, you will have these colors option here to completely customize this button. So let's change these colors just for you to see how it works. So the text color is orange on hover. It is, yeah, let's make it transparent orange a little. Background is green. That's gonna be a beautiful button. And again, that's just for you to see how it works. Hit save, now move back to the front end and hit refresh. Now this is beautiful. As you can see, the colors applied to the quick view button. I'll, let's reverse that real quick because I cannot look at that. As I said, it is just for you to get the idea. So this is basically all the plugin does. It adds this quick view. Let's change the text back. It adds this quick view button here to your WooCommerce shop pages and allows your visitors to quickly view um, all the product details. So the benefit of that obviously is that your visitor does not have to go to the product page and get all the information from here. They can just continue or they can just start shopping right from the shop page. So they can just click on quick view, select their product, add it to cart and continue shopping. All right, that is already it for this video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you're new here. Also hit that bell if you wanna be notified whenever I upload a new video. And yeah, as I said, I will have the links down below in the description. And if you have any further questions, let me know down below in the comments. I see you in the next video. Hey everyone, David here. And in this quick video, I'm going to show you how to add quick view function